to four. Welcome to the Doug Bailey Radio Show. Here's Doug Bailey. And if you're looking for something fun to do this weekend, Festa Italiana da, is back. Da, 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 da. See, I do my own music. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Willie Farrell in here. Yeah. And you know what? I think yeah. for most of us have been around here forever. Yeah. It's always Festa. You say Festa, everybody knows it's, what it is this time of year. You know, everybody, you know, it's St. Patrick's Day, everybody wants to be Irish. This weekend, let's all be Italian. Let's have some fun. Willie, how are you? I can't I've believe I've good. never talked to you in person yes. before. Well, I, I I hide a lot, so people don't see me dur- during the day. But uh, I, I this is uh, I'm I'm glad to be in this studio, sitting where I am. This is fun. It's been a long time since yes. you've been in the studio. Exactly. And, and where are you sitting at? I'm sitting in uh, Round Guy, RG's old uh, old chair. I can tell because it's almost all the way to the floor. I know. And so. that's we, we kept it here just as, as a uh, commemorative thing of, yes. of RG here. I can and, still uh, smell food over here in the corner. You know what? Uh, It'd be hard pressed to find somebody in this town that doesn't know about Festa Italiana. It's yeah. a staple of the South Side. Yes. I loved it when it mm-hmm. was on a smaller scale over on McKinley. What was that yeah. place called in McKinley? The, it was, well, it was uh, the, the culture of Italian. But the thing is, before that, a lot of people don't know, it used to be down in Columbus Park. You know where Columbus Park is? I forgot about that. Yeah, and and the thing is, and I joke about this, but I can remember back then, you would go there and guys would come up to me. It was so small. I mean, it was just a little park and it outgrew it. And people would, like a guy would come up to me and say, hey, I just had the best meatball sandwich over there at that stand. I'm like, what what stand? Right over there. That's Mrs. Tellerico's house. You know, they, they were <laughs> there were old Italian ladies feeding people at the festival. And, they and shouldn't you know, have been. I like how you say yeah. that in that Italian voice. Yeah. And, and, and you're you've been a, if yeah. I remember, right, you're a lifetime South Sider, aren't oh, you? Oh yeah, yeah. Born my my mother, uh, my mother's mother had a restaurant over on Southeast First Street called Aunt Jenny's back in the twenties. And uh, yeah, so I mean, and you know, my mother and father were married at St. Anthony's. Uh, we were all born, went to St. Yeah, we're South Siders uh, through and through. So. Love the South Side. Yeah. In the studio right now, you yeah. know the voice. It's Willie <laughs> Farrell, legend yeah. in comedy and uh, just a legend in this city. Yeah. And as I was as I was starting mm. to say, yeah. you'd be hard-pressed to find somebody in this city. Yeah. See, everybody's See. trying to get a hold of you. <laughs> God dang it. Okay. You'd be hard-pressed in this city to find somebody that does not know what Festa Italiana is. Yes. In, in the short, in the Reader's Digest condensed version, yeah. what is your description of Festa Italiana? It is a chance for us to show off uh, and, and let this, this town know uh, exactly what we've done and accomplished in this city. Uh, and, and you'll see that when you get down there at the Cultural Center, at the John Papa John Cultural Center. If you go inside, you'll see uh, our history in, in Iowa and what we've accomplished and, and the, what some people have done. And you can actually go in there and trace your, your heritage back to where, where it all started. Very proud of that. Very proud of our food. Very proud of uh, just being uh, able to... Um, be welcoming people. You know, we, we want everybody to come down. We want everybody to feel like they're Italian this weekend. We, you come down, you call me cuz, I'll call you cuz. We'll have a meatball sandwich. We'll You're not going to put bocce. anybody in the trunk, are you? Not, uh, well, if you if uh, if you beat me in bocce ball, we might have to. But, That's uh, right, we got bocce ball, oh, too. Yeah. I wouldn't even, I, I like to play you in bocce ball, but yeah. I think I'll let you win. <laughs> yeah, you can beat me. I can't, or I can't even I see the other side. Or do I need new shoes if I, if I beat you? Exactly. Um, <laughs> Entertainment-wise, I, I just want to know, we have uh, 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 Sons of Gladys Kravitz They're Friday awesome night. awesome band. They, aren't they great? They are unbelievable. Uh, and Saturday night, we have a group called Boz Sticks, which is actually uh, 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 people from Boston and people from Sticks. A guy named David Victor, I believe, mm-hmm. was, uh, yeah, and it's so... Boston in the early 2000s, I believe. Yeah, so uh, they're, they're going to be playing Saturday night. Uh, Gina Gedler, Severino, who's fantastic, uh, a fantastic singer. Uh, the Goombas are going to be there. Uh, which is there are a bunch of old Italian guys from uh, Kansas City walk around, play the accordion, and uh, sing with everybody. I love that accordion. And yeah, uh, that's just, on the main it's stage. Awesome music. Yeah, and then on the smaller stage, the heritage stage, uh, Francis Graziano's has uh, is going to have. Uh, they're going to be cooking demonstrations. There's going to be all kinds of contests, like meatball eating contest, cannoli eating contest. But there's everything. Anything that you think is Italian will be down there. Graziano's, man, yeah. I love that place. Isn't it the best? It, 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 it's so nice now. They, I mean, yeah. not that it was not, not nice before, but they've renovated it. It's they, a staple of the yeah. South Side. And you walk in there and you can smell. You can oh, smell I know. The, the smells. Are, that's what I remember as a little kid, just walking in there and just stopping and just taking it all in. Only place in this town I know to get authentic mortadello. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah. All right, Willie Farrell in the studio right now. We're talking Festa mm. this weekend down at the right. Western Gateway Park. Starts Friday at 11. That's right. Okay. I'm going to go out on a limb here. Yes, sir. What... Is the best Italian food in this city? Oh, uh, Maron, you can't do this to me. Uh, because I'm related to everybody. I know but, you uh, are. But I'll tell you. Do you, you want to uh, plead the fifth? Because you can yeah, plead out uh, if you want well, to. Well, you know what? Uh, in in the uh, in the uh, 
It's tradition of my father who went in front of uh, Robert F. Kennedy at the Keefe Offer Committee. Uh, I do plead the fifth on, on, on the fact that it might uh, uh, tend to uh, How about we me. do this? Mm. All Italian food in this city is unbelievable. Well, I awesome. mean, I'll just, uh, we'll just keep naming them. I mean, you got the Tamiyas and Sons. You got uh, a Latin King. You got uh, uh, Baradas. You got uh, uh, Noah's Ark. You got, I mean, you, just, you can go on and on and on. And uh, a lot of those people will be down there. So it'll be oh, a lot. Yeah. Scornavacas. That's uh, right. Bordneros. Paisanos, Orlando's. Something Italian. Something, oh yeah, yeah. Louis Barada, his stuff is fantastic. So I yeah. didn't mean to put you on the spot. No, no, no. I had to, though. I love it all. And, <laughs> and, and the funny thing is, is if you talk to these people, I, I, I frequent all their restaurants. They're all great. And Southside is. Southsiders yeah. stick together. Yes, you Southsiders bet. Southsiders stick yeah. together as well. Festa Italiana this weekend down at the uh, Papa John Sculpture Building yeah. down the Western Gateway Park. 11 a.m. Friday gets underway. You know, you can get in free if you bring just a, a canned food uh, uh, for the food bank. And Iowa. that's always been that way. That, yes. That's an awesome thing you guys yeah. have always done, and you yeah. continue to do that as well. Yes. We're Willie, proud of thanks it. a lot. We'll see you down there this weekend. All right, buddy. Thanks for listening to the Doug Bailey Podcast. And don't forget to subscribe to the show on your favorite podcast platform.